Hello YouTube, it is your boy B3 back with another kicking vlog. Uh, I've been vlogging about Toho's upcoming Godzilla Cinematic Universe a lot recently because I feel like we got to get it started, you know? I mean, I'm a, I already know everything that's pretty much going to happen in the MonsterVerse. We're going to have Godzilla 2019 and then we're going to have Kong vs. Godzilla, and then it's done. So we need to go ahead and start planning this new cinematic universe, he said, as if he had anything to do with its production. But I think that something really cool we could do is have solo films for other monsters, which Toho has already said they want to do. I guarantee you they'll make a Mothra and Rodan film. Those monsters will definitely get solo films. Maybe Varen will get a remake. Um... There are some other monsters that have good uh, single film potential. I even outlined why I think Gorosaurus should get a solo film in a previous vlog. But one monster that deserves a solo film isn't even a monster at all. It's goddamn Mecha Godzilla. Now, obviously not the evil alien Mecha Godzilla, but one of the human-made ones. Obviously a new design, and it'll be much better than that stupid shitty Mecha Godzilla from the anime trilogy. Stupid ass dumb shit. Fuck your trilogy. But I'm saying that before I've even seen the third one, but the other two are so bad. <laughs> but I think a Mecha Godzilla movie could work really, really well. So we'll probably have to do a film where Godzilla fights Mecha Godzilla first. That makes more sense, because why would you just make a Mecha Godzilla if you weren't planning to send it against something called Godzilla? It doesn't make sense. But you make a Mecha Godzilla, send it against Godzilla, it fails to beat Godzilla, but then they super upgrade it. Make it all new looking so they can sell more action figures. <laughs> and so that the film feels fresher, of course. Oh, sorry, I gotta sit down. Mm. And then. Maybe um, the Japanese Defense Forces discover an island or an underground utopia of some sorts. They discover an island crawling with monsters, a floating island that's coming closer and closer to Japan. And once it hits shores, the cities will be overrun with monsters. Or perhaps... Uh, a kind of journey to the center of the earth type thing. Hollow earth theory, like they had in Kong Skull Island. Where the monsters are all underground. In this weird prehistoric world. And they have to be exposed. To some death. <laughs> I kind of like the island idea better, the floating island. I think that's a pretty fun idea. Not to toot my own dick. But, um... They're like, how are we going to get rid of all these monsters? Well, we just fucking upgraded Mecha Godzilla. Let's send Mecha Goji to the island and just have him slaughter a shit ton of monsters. <laughs> like, just have him fight all these kind of smaller uh, monsters that we've never really seen before. Original monsters. Um, and then, after, after it's done fighting the original monsters... There's like a final boss on the island, uh, for lack of a better word. A monster from the Godzilla franchise that um, we know and makes sense to kind of be on a dinosaur-type island. Like perhaps Anguirus, huh? I mean, I don't see Anguirus getting a solo film, but I think that's a good idea because he's not in Toho's top five monsters that they like to use, but... Fan-wise, he might be number six or seven. He's pretty popular, despite not appearing much after the Showa. Or actually only appearing once after the Showa series ended. But Anguirus could be like the boss monster on that island. The last monster that Mechagodzilla has to fight. And don't make Anguirus as weak as he was, you know, in the Showa series. Make Anguirus bigger. Make him more formidable, you know? Make him more like Final Wars Anguirus but not with such a cartoony face. <laughs> Make him tough. But, um, 
I think a Mechagodzilla movie could work. I think it would work. And I think it should work. I think it would be a spectacular idea. And I think they should go for it. But that's just me. So let me know what you think about the idea of a solo Mechagodzilla film in the comments section below. Also remember to rate, comment, and subscribe so that you can get more awesome Godzilla content. Uh, not only do I do these Godzilla vlogs, but I also review lots of kaiju movies. Uh, I have a kaiju parody series or two on this account. Uh, I do action figure collection updates. And that's just the kaiju stuff I do on this channel. Not even my other channel. So definitely check it all out in the links below. So that's it. Thank you all once again for your support, and I'll see you all later.